Okay, I think, dude, this has to be like one of the top five worst ways to die in the entire franchise. All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching Final Destination 3. Now, like I mentioned in the last two movies, I knew a little bit about them before watching them, but everything I knew about Final Destination has now happened in the first two movies. So I have no idea what's going to happen in this movie. I have no idea what the incident's going to be, what, what the premonition vision is going to be in the very beginning, but I'm very excited to see, and I'm very excited to see all the deaths. See, what's fun about these movies is that we know the characters is gonna die we just don't know how they're gonna die like once they beat it the first time then it's like we have no idea how they're gonna die and the movie the movies like to pump fake us by making us think it's one thing and then no they just no but anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this movie if you'd like to watch the full length reaction that will be available on patreon as well as early access to the next two final destination movies will also be available on patreon and youtube memberships so click the join button down below but anyways let's get started Oh god, dude, so many things can go wrong at a carnival, and this is gonna be so fucked. This is gonna make me never want to go to a carnival ever again, or go or get on any type of ride ever again. But then again, like, usually it's some, like, bullshit chain of events that cause an accident. So it's like, yeah, alright, that would never happen, but... I've actually, I've never been on this ride, and I never will. Oh god, what's the photo of? Was there a demon in your photo? What? Oh my god. Okay, come on. It won't kill us to get a deep fried Snickers in a Coke. Before riding. A deep fried Snickers? What the? F actually, doesn't sound too bad. Do you ever have a deep fried banana? It's not bad. It's actually pretty good. I mean, you know, I'm such a control freak. Like, I couldn't handle that. I'm breaking up with him. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, all right, so I'm a total whore. Well, that's gonna be tough when he's dead. <laughs> because, like, Kimberly's entire frame group in the last movie got fucking wiped out. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna look back at these photos later, and there's gonna be so many signs of them. You can run, but you cannot hide. <laughs> Literally, coming from the devil. Coming from death. It looks like Tom Cruise. Not really, just, like, certain angles. Certain shots. I was having that feeling like deja vu, you know, except for something that hasn't happened yet. Hey. So deja vu, okay. Yeah, odds are like 1 in 250 million of dying on a roller coaster. Yeah, yeah, thanks for that. Yeah, not in Russia. That shit is not regulated there. Hey, uh, just do me a favor, keep an eye on her, okay? She's kind of freaked out. Oh, cool. She might need some covering and I'll have to beat her for okay? Hey, no, no, he's finding another cockpit, Top Gun. No, get... Just... Bro, you gr bro, you graduated like three years ago. Get the fuck out of here, <laughs> fucking super senior. Guess who's back? He's a <gasps> fucking weirdo. All right. Cool. Hey, how'd you guys? Oh, these kids are gonna get decapitated. Come on. Oh, you too. Out. Ready? Oh, never mind. What's up, man? I'm good. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Oh, well, can I just put it in my pocket, man? No. Cool? Yeah. Yeah? Oh. Cool. Thanks, buddy. Just gonna take someone's head off. Yeah, bro, there's no way you can record while going out. You know, you know how shitty that footage is gonna be anyway? Even if, like, you manage to hang on to it. The audio on that is fucked. And you're just gonna be shaking all over. It's not gonna be usable at all. And then... Hi. Their seats are gonna come undone, and people are just gonna go flying out. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh! Yeah, see, it's bullshit like that. <laughs> the other seats are coming undone. <laughs> Bro, the shitty thing, even if you hang on to that shit with your life, the momentum of like this roller coaster would throw you out. Oh! 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 Oh, dude. Oh, okay, dude, show us. Oh, well, I'll just, I'll put it in my pocket. Okay? Oh, give me the fuck off this right now. No, don't no. push the button. Don't, don't push the button. Wait. Most of them just do it anyway. If someone keeps, like, if someone's freaking out like that. I've seen it before. It's fucked. Whoa. Relax. Now, 
What's the matter? Yeah, bro, I would not want to be on this if someone else freaked out. You no, know you're a real piece of shit, Lewis. Fuck you. Mm -hmm. Oh, man, fuck you. Mm -hmm. And everyone ends up getting off. Dude, let me off. Let's go. Hey, Damn. Uh, RP Jason. Hey, everything will be taken care of. <laughs> I made a promise to Jay that I would take care of you. On the ride for three minutes. We're making the promise for a lifetime. If it wasn't for you and Jay being friends, and me and Carrie being friends, we wouldn't have even hung out. Mm hmm. We don't even like each other. I feel like it doesn't have to be raining for this. <laughs> but like. I had a kiss it that my last name is the same as my high school. Julie. Wow. Well, this feels like Twilight. Like the tone right now. Um, you're so totally cool if you want to come with. And just like talk if you want. Here's myself. No, nah, she's too quirky and edgy for you guys. That was Yeah. This feels like an indie movie. <laughs> and I found out about this high school French class from New York. They went on a trip to Paris. Yep. The kid had a vision that the plane was gonna explode. Just like you did. He freaked out and seven people got off the plane. Everyone who got off that plane started dying in weird accidents. Fuck you, Kevin. Dude, I am not rooting for her at all. Hey, no drinks in the room this time, okay? Mm. Yep, they're gonna die. They're gonna mess up the tanning beds and... Oh my god. Uh... Maybe it's supposed to be colder for the machines or whatever. Oh, a few degrees won't hurt. Hmm... Oh god, no, it, that, yep, I see exactly what's gonna happen, that drink, it's gonna have a couple drops missing, and then the wind, or whatever, <laughs> manipulate the water to go right down on the machine, the machine's gonna spark, and it's gonna electrocute both of them. Yep, 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 yep. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, the voltage is going up, and it's gonna fry them, cook them, and then they're not gonna be able to get out. The machine's gonna lock or something. I don't, even, I don't even think there is a lock on them, but like, it's gonna, they're gonna be trapped somehow. That would be stupid if there was a fucking lock on them for this exact reason. <laughs> Someone could get stuck in them. I fucked up. I said it too hot in here. Dude, I could, I dude, I couldn't be in a tanning bed. I'd get too claustrophobic. Oh. Oh, okay, that's how they get stuck. <laughs> okay. Actually, it's windy. Bye. <laughs> so my friend's voicemail used to be, you'd be like, hello? Hello? I can't hear you, speak up. And he just went on like that for like a minute. <laughs> oh. oh, is this dude not gonna be able to open the door? Oh my God. Oh, 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 fuck. the blisters, ah. Dude, this would be a terrible way to die. Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. Okay, I think, dude, this has to be like one of the top five worst ways to die in the entire franchise. Has to be. Oh. Um, two. We may feel. Damn. Right next to each other. Yeah, dude, that has to be like a top five way to die. That was fucking brutal. Because, like, it's not a quick death. You're suffering through that. Equal. In death sign. All of us. How can you say that? <laughs> Shut up, McKinley. Charlie Manson. He made it to 70. Osama. Let's go. Still kicking. Pimps. <laughs> not anymore. Lit his house with red dots like it had a rash. Yeah, those are the two edgy kids. Be down, Frankie. Be proud of your ability to make everything that happens somehow a story about you. Jesus Christ. Bro, what are you doing? Jesus Christ, bro, both of them. There's no social awareness. And she's just a bitch. Hello? I'm with Jay. I see I see what they're doing with her character. <laughs> She's like the she's like the one character from an indie film, like the girl who who's different, and like she's like I have to get out of this small town, and then just self-deprecates herself. Yeah, I could have gotten you second row. I didn't want to upset anyone by being. There. She, yeah, yeah. See, like that. And I wondered if maybe here I could feel the spirit or presence. Yep. <laughs> get me on the ride, he said. Your fear is from a sense of having no control. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this franchise definitely peaked with the first movie. <laughs> the photographic plate was broken, causing a line that can't be removed. Exactly where he was shot. Look, see the shadow? It's in your head. 
with the Flight 180 thing. And, and it did happen, and it may be occurring here, but you can't believe every weird thing out there because you're desperate for an answer. I took these. It's the order of who dies. When was the last time you ate? I don't remember. Girl, pay attention to the road. So oh, Jesus. Mm. Or maybe it's not that literal, right? What's could there be anything in these prizes? Or what? Like he's gonna get crushed oh. by? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I thought they were about to just get fucking rear-ended. Hey, SpongeBob lives underwater. It's so sad that you know that. I hate this bitch. I hate her, dude. I'm sorry. I really like the last two main characters, Alex and Kimberly. I hate this girl. I hope she does not make it through this movie. Yes, yes. Oh. Hey, that guy's way. No one in that truck! Watch Ooh. it. Come on, let's go. Come on, come on. Oh! It's better not knowing. No, it's never better staying ignorant. Willful ignorance is surrendering control. Hmm. Yeah. That's it. That's the clue. We have to tell him. Show him these pictures. Wouldn't you want to know? No. No. No, I don't want to see mine. No. Mm. What about willful ignorance? Well, I'm full of shit, all right? Yeah, I don't want I don't want to know how I die. That's horrible. I got to stay focused and if I look at that picture all I'm going to do is obsess. So, you know what? No, I don't want to see it. I mean, you'll know what to look out for at least, but like <clears throat> You'll crack. Like this Slice his head off. It's gonna short circuit. Yo. Luis Romero going in the second round of Oakland. Oh, if you're going to Oakland, your career is over, bro. I'm sorry. It's over before it even starts. 15 seasons with four Super Bowl rings on his fingers. You want four Super Bowl rings at 15? That's not happening. I mean, that's how funny. Okay, I'm gonna, I am a Raiders fan. But like dog, I live in Vegas now. But when this movie came out there in Oakland, he was saying afraid no death. Fuck death. Death is a fucking different fan. Fuck the Broncos. Fuck death. Oh. 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 Okay. Didn't. Okay. Didn't kill him. <laughs> no. Someone else is gonna get him. Kevin, baby, I just win. No. <laughs> Oof. Jesus, you god damn. That was pretty brutal. I feel like this movie is just it's focusing more on the deaths, making the deaths insanely brutal, but the character development is not working at all in this movie. Like uh, it's a big no, Pip. Osama bin supervisor wants me to get rid of these pigeons first. They keep set Bro, what is this infatuation with it's like the third there's like the fourth reference to that. Like what Hello babies. Jesus, this was a psychopath. But this movie came out in 2006, and uh, Raiders, they weren't looking good back then, and then they still really aren't. They had, they had a couple highs in between then and now, but, like, it, it, very short-lived. They weren't even, like, good in 2006. They were good in 2002, but, like, that's it. That was the last year they were, like, good, good, you know? Why the fuck does he want to go there? <laughs> He's probably just a fan. He he wants to be the reason why they turn it around there, and that's, why, that's what it is. It's his ego. Hey, watch those boxes! Oh, bro, he's only doing that because you shouted at him. Mm, okay, never mind. The boxes. Really? What for? They're not doing anything. We're not going to apologize for trying to save you. People die. That's just part of life. 150,000 people a day, actually. He wouldn't know that fact. How can you explain what happened to us as simple? I mean, if Wendy never had that premonition Ooh. and none of us had gotten... No one goes like, oh, wow, he was eating French... Okay. Oh, she picked him up. On TV, and now he's dead. You know why? Because they. Oof. <laughs> oh, oh. That was very close, bud. This goddamn forklift. Yeah, okay. See, it's this bullshit chain of events. The last in line. Or to make the utilitarian choice. Hmm. Kill themselves. Yeah. Pretty much gonna ruin any plan the desk put in motion. And even better, five skipped lives. That would be her, that would be Wendy. Any takers? Well, obviously she's not gonna do it. There! Those! Oh! Damn, bro, Delphi just keeps- Oh! 
Oh, fuck. Oh. oh, that's fucking brutal. Oh my god. Alright, well, we saved him, but RIP her. Ian almost died first, but we intervened. So it skipped Ian. That's, that's how we regain control. Going by the way we said on the roller coaster. Well, I'm next. We can beat this. I hope not. We're so close, we can't give up. I really hope they don't. I like the dude, but the girl's so annoying. <laughs> dude, she's such a pick me girl, dude. No, it's just. I'll just be freaking out every second. Yep. <laughs> Oop. No, yep, him. Now he's now he's curious. We've picked his interest. He wants answers. Oh yeah, it was her sister. Mm-hmm. Yep. She just took that. Well, RIP her sister. Do you remember Julie being on the roller coaster? What, your sister? No. I'm on my way. When? Wait. Look, after them, we're next. Remember that time we talked about when to look at our pictures? Mm. Let's do it. It's now. Let's do it. Do it right now before you leave so we know. All right, let's see this shit. <laughs> Great. Mine has no clue. It's just me standing in front of a blank background with Jason at the end. Yeah, but Jason's face is blank. Well, uh. Ian. Ooh. Like a firework went off my face. Death by fireworks. Hmm. It's like, I don't even know his name, but the dude who was with that girl just died. Yeah, they're really just milking the franchise at this point. <laughs> they should have stopped after the second. They're just milking it, though. This movie just feels like a cash grab. Okay, sure. No, no. <laughs> Bro. Oh, that's gonna take her head off. That's gonna take someone's head off. Take your sister's head off with that, please. Let me explain this to you. Mm. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh. oh, no, she's about to choke. Oh, no. Oh, okay, I didn't kill her. They stopped her. They stopped the horse. Oh, no, never mind. No, nah, she should have got farmed right there. You have to tell me. You have to listen. Tell me who was sitting next to you on the roller coaster. Oh my god, are you right? Bro, she just had a near-death experience. Do you think she's gonna be able to remember this right now? <gasps> oh! That's tough. Yep, that means Kevin's next. <gasps> oh. Oh, he's not dead. Doesn't mean he's dead. But he's got he's got Anakin Skywalkered for a second. Bro, is this fool gonna come and try and kill them? I mean, yeah, his last name's McKinley. Yeah, he's pissed because his his shoddy got murdered. In my picture, I was wearing the McKinley Grand Knight shirt. He's the clue. Yeah. Do I cause your death? If you just stay away, then it'll all be over. It's gonna get him. It skipped me. No, it didn't. For me, no, it didn't. It is over. No, it didn't. I'm not dying. I'M NOT DIED! Yes, you are, right here. Oh, a miss. Missed? Okay. Nah, there's gonna be one more that's gonna just go right through him. They own some. That sign said McKinley on it, too. Five months later, alright. Mmm, that song. She heard in the car. Oh, don't sit in front of the window. Oh, 180. She's not gonna be able to get off. Oh my god. Is that Julie? I think I had a sense that you were coming now. Ian was gonna cause your death. You intervened and it skipped us. Mm -hmm. But it didn't. Oh, Yo, he just happens to be on the subway too? Alright. What are the chances? How long have you been on this train? Yeah. Something wrong? Ooh! Oh, RIP rap. Damn, all three are gonna die right here. 
RP Julie. Oh, we have flashes. Oh. There's no way she's still alive. I swear to God, if it shows her, if it shows her being alive, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh my. Nah, she's on the tracks. I hope she just gets ran over. Oh, another train is coming. Fuck off. I thought the movie was just gonna end right there. But yeah, the train's already going. What can we do to possibly stop it? Nothing. Yep. Alright, well that was Final Destination 3. Personally, I think the first two were way better than this one. I couldn't really get into this movie, to be honest. It, it was hard for me to get invested into the characters because there wasn't really much character development on anyone. Like, I didn't care about any of them dying or not. And, and the first two, I was rooting for them to hopefully make it, even though, like, we know they're gonna die. Alex survived the first movie, but then he he died, like, off screen in the second one. He, he got hit by a brick. <laughs> like, what? And then, like, Clear, I figured she's probably gonna die too. But what I mean is, like, I didn't want them to die, even though it's inevitable. They didn't develop any of the characters at all. They literally just introduced them and then killed them off, is what it felt like, the football player. You know, you can compare him to Carter in the first movie, Movie. like yeah they're both douchebags in the very beginning you know both dickheads but then by the end of the first movie like carter's actually a likable character he's actually a bro you know but no they didn't bother to do that with this guy at all like no they just keep him a dickhead the entire time until you kill him and like with the two girls in the tanning bed like i understood the stereotype they're going for but like they really weren't that bad of characters like i don't want i didn't really want them to die they're actually really nice they're just complete bimbos but they were really nice still like they invited wendy to come with them you know as a gesture to make her try and feel better it's a very sincere thing to do. You know, they weren't like their typical two girls that are bimbos, but they're super mean. Like, no, these girls are actually really nice. But then Wendy just decided to blow them off. Like, no, I don't fit in with you. You know, they're going for like that kind of vibe with Wendy and it just didn't work at all. It made Wendy super unlikable because of that. Like, she's just a bitch for like no reason, just because of how she perceives herself. Like, oh, I'm too different. Like, nobody likes me. No one wants to be my friend. Like, no, stop. They meant it in a sincere way. Like, they're actually trying to comfort you. Like, if the two girls are like really mean to her, they asked her in a really condescending way because they were gonna try and like you know make fun of her later and like if they were trying to set her up to make fun of her later then that, that would, that's completely different but the fact that like, they meant it in a sincere way makes Wendy unlikable in this situation like no I'm too different I'm too quirky for you guys nobody likes me I hate you know it's like stop and it felt like with Kevin they just kept him a moron on purpose to try and get him to ask Wendy questions so she could figure everything out you know and then Wendy would just have this attitude about her and I just I couldn't get into her character at all where she would just give a super condescending response or whatever you know I like how everything's about her and how she's such a control freak oh my god like i just i couldn't get into her character at all but yeah that was final destination 3 comment down below what you thought about this movie down below in the comments and if you like the video like the video and thanks for watching